good morning, everybody. Good morning from Knobles. I'm at Knobles Grove today, and we're going to have a great day at uh, everybody's happy place. Uh, Knobles Grove has been around since 1926, and it is one of the last operating uh, free amusement parks here in America, in Elysburg, Pennsylvania, and we're going to show you what's around and what you can do all kinds of special events this year as uh, they are celebrating uh, the Haunted Mansion's 50th year and I'll look into that and we'll get some great food and we'll get to look around and see what else is uh, what else is around so we are here at one of the food courts at Knobles and one thing I love, Knoebel's Foods is absolutely great. Uh, their breakfast is good. You get all this and all this for for good $7. It's not bad, and it's good. It's fresh. Sausage, potatoes, eggs, toast, and a nice cup of coffee. So, yeah. Come to Knoebel's and try their food. It's really, really, really good. Welcome, everybody, to the Haunted Mansion. No, this is not Disney's Haunted Mansion. This is Knobel's famous Haunted Mansion. And this year, they celebrate a milestone of 50 years. And in the old Knobel's fashion, they go all out. They have gone literally all out for this thing. Uh, well, let's there's a sign over here. They've gone, you know with collectibles. They might be bringing some things back uh, Honda Mansion 50th there will be collector tickets uh, Some of the things you see in the Haunted Mansion and I've also heard they might be bringing some things back to this So They have a whole birthday cake out here. Oh, gee. That door just slammed. It gave me a heart attack. <laughs> oh, yeah. So I knew they decaled the 50th uh, on the back here. 50th Haunted Mansion decals on the back of the... Um, on the cars for this year. Nice decals on the back of each one. I want to take a ride today. I don't know if I will. I may, I may not. I don't know. I don't know. I know. It's a separate ticket. It's a separate ticket. This is not... This... There's actually a separate company that owns this ride. But Knoebel's um, has it in their park. But because it's separate admission, is probably because there's, there is a separate company that owns this ride. Um... So the profits, I believe, go to that company. But maybe, maybe if it's not busy, and as I said, it's a separate admission. But I don't know. I may just take a ride today. If I do, I might have it on my channel. So yes, this year, say happy birthday to the Haunted Mansion for its 50th birthday.
on our way to Stratosphere. I loathe that ride. This thing over here. I tell you, I can't believe I was brave enough. And this was this uh, tornado ride was added last year. Last year, year before. Nice little addition. And then you got Stratosphere over here. Doesn't seem like downdrafts open. Ferris wheel's running. The, the sky is so hazy right now, it's smoky. It's crazy, especially up here in the mountains right now, it's hazy. Impulse is running. So we're here at the food court. We got that. I I actually took a bite of the burger already. It's good. Got a nice set of onion rings here. For, they still give you a lot for the price. You got a lot of that stuff going. It's really good. You got that big fish sandwich. And, and no quick note on that. When I was here a couple years ago for like October, I think I got that thing. They had it in a hamburger bun, but now I think they finally realized that it was too big and they put it in like a um, hot dog bun, like a big hot dog bun. It looks better. You know, I like it. I love their fish here. So, good food here. Street Knobles in here. It's like a small museum. It's really nice. See all the history of Knobles. whole timeline from literally from when it opened in 1926 to up till now but this is even before the park itself opened um, this is the history of the original Mr. Knoebel Because before he made an amusement park, it was much like many places, like a, a lake or what they call a watering hole. And and initially, the, the idea grew bigger and bigger to make it a public place for people to come and see. 
Ah, yes. And then 1925, the star here was the year, the grand opening of Knoebels. And the timeline goes the whole way down there. It's insanity. In 2026, this this park will turn 100 years old. You know, it's, yeah, it's, this place has a wonderful long history. Okay, so, Twister here at Knoebels. This monstrosity of a wonderful wooden coaster is the Twister. And recently, this past winter, they took the double helix, the entire thing, and rewooded it. The, the double helix is probably the best part of this whole roller coaster. So, um, it pulls G forces. I don't know if I can get up a little closer, really start to see the wood. A brand new spanking wood right there. The whole and now the bottom of this is still the old wood, but the you get to come over here and see like the the, the whole thing. Brand new wood. That entire helix. Take a walk over here. Let's see if we can't um, get a close shot of them coming around here soon. Again. There you go. Yep. Oh, they did such a good job. Alright, if you haven't seen any Knobles yet, you must try it out. It is a frozen iced tea. Yes, if you like slushies, it's basically an iced tea, iced tea slushy. Cold brew. Really good price. Um, they're really nice. I, uh, I do enjoy these things really good. If you're an iced tea fanatic, you gotta try it. So, yeah. Iced tea, uh, frozen iced tea, they call it. Like an iced tea slushy. Opened in 1947 was this outdoor bandstand. Here people can come sit, listen to live music, uh, and listen to bands and local bands. Have a nice seating area, nice trees around the area, and one of the main things here at uh, Knoebels. So yeah, check it out. Everyone take a seat, enjoy some music. Here's a place to do it. Scooter. 
are the bumper cars here at Knoebels. Rated just about the best bumper cars in America, wherever. Uh, these are really honestly probably the best, best bumper cars you can ride at any amusement park. We're gonna take a look. There's no one on it. There's actually a pizza place over here that has pretty good pizza, but I didn't get pizza. I went across the way to one of their round um, food stands and got a, myself a cheesesteak. Uh, they saw all kinds of things at that round place. Each section is different, but I uh, never had a cheesesteak here before, so I'm going to try that out. And, of course, I have to have birch beer. Every time I come here, I have to have a birch beer. Large birch beer is what I got. So if you like birch beer, Knoebel sells it. Uh, all right. Did you enjoy it?
Just so if you want to know, Spaghetti Nights will return, I believe, next week. Every Wednesday from 4 to 7 p.m. All kinds of good Italian food, if you like Italian food. Carousel, one of the very few left that you grab the brass ring from the side and you throw it in like a lion's mouth. There aren't many of these left. I mean, there are carousels left, but not unlike this one here. Probably one of the best. Golden Ticket Award, too. So do try their carousel when you come out. It's a good ride. Thank you for joining me for this Knobles vlog. I hope you had a good time. I uh, love Knobles. Knobles is uh, probably one of the best parks in Pennsylvania. And I'd say in America as well as it is one of the last freestanding free, um, uh, free admission amusement parks here. And Knobles family has just taken great care of this place and always will. As long as they are in business with it. And uh, long live Knobles always so you all have a great day thank you all so much